Batman the Cape Crusader, episodes 6 through 10, Quick Thoughts. Okay, okay, it's not this. It's not this. It's not this either. It's definitely not this, but some good vibes associated with this. I enjoyed it more than this, but this is still an enjoyable show. Was it better than this? Yes. In my opinion, yes. Now, there's probably more that I could talk about, about how... Uh, it compares to what I enjoy when it comes to Batman and when it comes critically to what, how it compares to other Batman stories. I will say that episodes 6 through 12 were much more enjoyable, much more entertaining, much more engaging than the first five episodes. I think these last uh, episodes 6 through 10 really got the essence of Batman down. We got more of Batman. We did get more of the supporting characters as well. Um... All in all, I thought it ended well. Now, it did end on a cliffhanger. No spoilers in this video. But I don't know how much more you're going to set up because of the new direction that DC is going. Now, unless this is an exception and it falls under the DC Elseworlds storyline, then that's different. I will say that if you want a vintage Batman and you like the style, and I was corrected earlier that it's in the 40s, then you will enjoy it. I think you will like it. You will see what you remember and what they were trying to do and what they're trying to set up. Now, I'm not saying it's perfect, but I do recommend it, especially if you are a Batman fan. We'll talk more soon. More thoughts coming. This is just fresh ones. Quick thoughts. Talk to you later.